It was good you could come in so quickly. I know this is overwhelming, but try and understand. There was nothing else we could do. Your father had a bleed in his brain, which caused him to have a seizure, which in turn affected his ability to breathe. And then basically his heart stopped working. He died on the way to hospital. What is it? I knew something was wrong. He started throwing up. I told him we had to come back to the hospital. When was this? Last night. He said he was feeling fine. This morning, it was really hard to wake up. I see. If I would brought him back last night, would you be able to stop the bleed? Uh, these things are very hard to predict. But you had a chance, right? Are the rest of the family coming in? They'll be here soon. Would you like a cup of tea or something? No. I want to see him. Can I see him? Of course you can. I mean, it is a good guy and everything. It's just he can treat you like scum sometimes. I can handle it. You shouldn't have to. Hey, why did you kiss me? To show you how you should be treated. If Eddie's not killed, some guy's going to move in on you. Is that what you're trying to do? If I thought I had a chance. So, is it over or not? I don't know. But you said he wants to break up, right? Okay, I gotta go. I'll see you around then. Yeah. I knew you'd make it. Next step, crutches. Next step after that, getting you out of here, right? Mm. What's up, Cass? I'm okay, bro. Scarlet did this really cool little chat that we met. It's kind of like a timeline. And today, he made it to here. Standing with support. For what? Three seconds. Hey, your wahine's all right. She's not my wahine anymore. I told her where to go. Well, you can make it up to her when she gets back. I don't think she'll be coming back. She will. Trust me. Hey, she's a chick. She knows this stuff. Hey, um, I've got to get back to work. But, um, bring Mark around for dinner soon. I think Lee May needs a bit of a total call. If I can tear him away from work, I'll come. Sweet. And, um, I suggest you sit here and think about what you're going to say to Scarlett. Starting with, sorry, babe, maybe. He's right, you know. It'd be a shame if you guys broke up. You're really sweet. Well, that's what we've been waiting for. A smile. Give Scarlett one of those and everything will be sorted. Mrs. Weaver, welcome to Shortland Street. We'll have you on a proper bed as soon as we can, okay? Did you have a good fight? Not too bad. Hot up north. Stifling. Mm. All right, you fellas, take a break and we'll regroup at 1800. We're doing overtime. I'm okay with it. All right, we'll meet at admissions and then we'll transfer to the Coltrane Wing, adjacent to the hospital, for debriefing, rehydration and nutritional supplements. Isn't there a bar around here called Coltrane? That's the one. Here she comes now. You okay? Yeah, fine. Is it all right if I come in? Yeah, very all right. Good luck. Hey. I just came to get my books. Guess what? What? I did it. I met up to there on the chart. You stood up? Yeah. After they gave me a painkiller, I managed. Just. They had to hold me, though. That's great, I'm glad. Scarlet, wait. I'm sorry. I wasn't angry at you. I was angry at me. I just, you know, took it out on you. What do you want, E.T.? I try everything, but it's like you hate me. No. I want you to, I want you to call me a jerk and... Forgive me. Please. Come here. I want to tell you something. What? 
I love you. I, I, lo I love you too.